On this week's Scouting Report, we talk Clint Dempsey, Sebastian Giovinco, and an MLS Cup Finals rematch. Hey, what's up everyone? Steve Zakawani here, and welcome to the Quest Diagnostic Scouting Report. Good health starts with knowing. It's an MLS Cup Finals rematch, Toronto versus Seattle, in the same location, and it promises to be a very, very good game. For these two teams to win, there's a lot that has to go right. But on each side, there is one key guy who can turn this game just on their individual talent alone. For Toronto, that guy is Sebastian Giovinco. They have Michael Bradley, they have Josie Altador, but on any given day, the main man they look to when things get tough is Giovinco. He was off in last year's final, coming off an injury. Wasn't even on the pitch when he went to penalty kicks because he came out because he couldn't play a whole 120 minutes. This year, doesn't have that injury. He's played in all the playoff games. He's been suspended for one, so he's been arrested. And now for Toronto, they're hoping he can be somewhere near his best form. And for Seattle to stop him, they have to be aware of what he does well. His movement off the ball, very, very good. Once he gets the ball, he can shoot from distance. He can go left, he can go right. He's a tiny, tiny guy, but he's so agile and quick that Roman Torres and Chad Marshall will have to be very aware of where he is at all time. You have to force the ball to everyone else but him because when he gets around it, he's very good at passing. And once he gets into the 18-yard box, he can give the assist or he can also find a way to finish once he's inside your 18-yard box. For the Sounders, their main man is back this year and not just back, but back and in form. That is Clint Dempsey. He wasn't even on the pitch last year. We weren't sure he'd be here this year, but he's helped propel this team to the finals and no one wants this more than him. What does Clint Dempsey do so well? This is a broken record, but he can shoot left foot, he can shoot right foot, inside the box, outside the box. At this stage of his career, his timing of his run is tremendous. Just when to make that run behind the last defender and get the ball from a Jovin Jones or Will Bruin. He's figured out the right way to be effective off the ball as well as on the ball. If the Sounders can get him involved, get his touches going early in the game, then they really have a great chance to repeat as MLS Cup champions and upset Toronto for the second year running at BMO Field. And as always, you can catch all the action live at 1 p.m. on ESPN this Saturday or listen in on radio, Cairo Radio 97.3 and El Rey 1360 AM.